Okay, in this next sound, I want to create a dark, kind of suspenseful sound. Something you might use in a film or for a fairly dark track. Let's have a look. I've got both oscillators set to sawtooth. I've kept them relatively in tune with one another. They're just slightly offset. I've set the interval or octave range to be low and high respectively, and I've also set the mix levels to be even at 50% apiece. The modulator here is set to a sine shape and I've cranked the frequency or rate up to 10. Both my tremolos are set to zero at this point, but I'm gonna come back to them in a moment. My filter is all the way up to 20 kilohertz and my cue is right down. So that's just gonna give me a bright, even sound without any resonance. My modulator is set to around about 20% and my envelope is set to around about 50%. With my volume envelope, I've set it to a relatively fast attack and a fast decay. My sustain level is upright high and my release time is relatively high as it is in the filter envelope where the other parameters have been set to their minimum. So the idea here is to give it a bright sound that kind of swells in and then allows it to run off and decay with a harmonic content. Notably, my reverb is slightly up and my volume level is about 75%. Okay, let's have a listen. Note, I'm playing this a couple of octaves up on the keyboard because that's where I get the kind of dark suspenseful sound that I'm looking for. Okay, and you can hear that it decays out nicely. Notably, if I want to give it a bit more of a menacing kind of feel to it, I can crank these tremolos right up. Let's have a listen now. And it just gives a sound, that kind of movement and flurry about it, which I like. <laughs> 